Gotta get that nasty feline down. Oh, sorry. Oh, don't run away. There's my pride. You gotta check this out. It's okay. I've got friends in New York, and this proves it. And what's cool about having friends in New York is one of them owns this company, the Cheesefield Company. Check it out. That cat. I know, I'm sorry. <laughs> so anyway, this one... <laughs> I've showed you these before a long time ago, but anyway, if you go to their website, you can see all this. This is this is my decoration. I made this real quick. <laughs> this one used to be a whole uh, all-in-one. What's cool about that one? It's got the cheese and cracker filled pepperoni, and he mailed this to me cold. It arrives cold and ready, and you just take it out of the box and put it back in the thing in the fridge. So anyway. <laughs> That's all that's left because the offspring mangled it before I had a chance to uh, show it to you. That one's pepper jack. That one's cheese with pepperoni. Cheese with pepperoni. And that's the all-in-one. So I'm excited. These, this is the sharp one. That's one of my favorites. That's a cat. It's not supposed to be here. You know my next, the oldest offspring who drug home a chicken also brought that home. So we kept it. But anyway, thank you, Gene. This is awesome. So excited. My brother says, stop, you're eating that showpiece that I created here. It's good. All right, let's move on. Oh, I forgot to tell you this part. You know how I always stop and start over. I'll put the link to his site in the video description. A lot of people don't read the description, but that's where a lot of stuff is. This here you stick on your fridge or on the side of your car. I'm putting it on the side of my wagon. What? Okay, that's gonna be something else. She's laughing at me because I'm not a good spokesperson. This video is a continuation of a video that's not this one. I am waiting on Brandon. Oh, it's broken. I'm waiting on Brandon. The last video is the one where I found the, uh, the tall hut. And uh, this is the one where I found the pickle jar. And put the broken one in it. That's consolidating at its finest. He ought to be rolling up any minute now. I hope. That's deep down there. But I think we can get there a different way. through this when I get home way a lot too far <laughs> so <laughs> it gives me song just popped into my head when I said I want to dig all through this there's some old electrical apparatus all right let's go wait on him I got another one Kind of dirty. I don't think it's old. I think it's a mod. Let's clean it. Ah, it is old. Coca-Cola straight side. Nice. That's not nice. So we'll add this. This will need some cleaning. Still got my pickle jar in paradise and my stray side. I forgot where I came through these depths. Brandon is here. There's a bottle that is embossed. Oh, the top is broke off. That ain't cool. I 
just clean it. Pepper sauce. Martinsville, Louisiana. <laughs> Brandon that's made your, it. That's a, uh, I'll tell you why this yeah. is such a tough hutch. The way that that top is, this is like a newer glass. This is one of the last hutches they made before they went to crown tops. And this glass is really similar to a root glass. Oh, and that so top gets snapped off very, very easily. So it's not as thick as all these other yeah, ones. it's not quite as thick. Oh, look at that stopper still in it and everything. Isn't that cool? But that's a Jefferson County Inslee. Man, that's awesome, dude. I know, and to be this far south from there, it's pretty awesome. But yeah. it's got that crack at the base. Yeah, it got a little bit of a nick out of there. But to be honest with you, that's pretty good shape for one of these. That's a killer bottle, man. Awesome, thanks. This is interesting. I found one the other day. I didn't show you, but when you and I were in a creek together, what, what is that? Mm, two those are springs, aren't they? Yeah. I don't know what that is. Well, it's some kind of tensioner for wire. I'm not going to haul it. It is eventually be gone all by itself yeah i'm glad brandon's here i mean i can pull out a bottle but i wanted him to be the first to partake in our new little spot i want to show you this but check out this this is a engraved brick which is a common brick from birmingham but i've never seen one that says chemical number one on it oh that's cool that's pretty neat we're gonna get that on the way back out for sure yeah, this is that plate I picked up. Let's see what it says. Let's clean it off. It's a real heavy plate. I know y'all are looking these things up when I find them. I'm trying to hang on. It's crusty, isn't it? Oh, it may not be that old, huh? I don't know. Does it say iron or something? Yeah, it looks like it. Okay, here we go. Oh, Iroquois, China. Huh. Airport China, so that may not be that old. We'll put it with this brick. Be an extra reminder, we have walked right back past our finds and forgot them. So somebody else got them. <laughs> I did not. He picked a, a ditch to climb up in. Ow, and found another chemical brick right off the bat. Oh, that's cool. Isn't that cool? Graves chemical number one. Or actually the one is gone. So you don't, that's just number. Oh, this is a, this is a mess. His is a, uh, a lot nicer than mine. But that's okay. In New York, I got a boo boo. Okay, those. That one has the full number one. This one is missing the number one. So those will be right there. We'll come back through. There is another chemical brick. That one has the number one on it. So what I'm going to do is choose All right. <laughs> He's throwing bricks out. There's three graves, chemical number one bricks. That one's more brown than the red ones. I thought I saw another couple of bricks in here, but I did not. Yes, I did. There's another hole. Graves chemical number one. Let's get it out of there. You didn't take your allergy medicine like I told you to, huh? There's a Graves chemical number one missing the end of the word Graves. That was so cool. And he just hauled three more out. No, four. So that's eight. <laughs> I kind of think it's a throwing horseshoe. That's kind of what I'm thinking. That's a lot bigger than a standard horseshoe. Yeah, that's pretty big. That's pretty cool though. 
we're still headed upstream here's a pretty cool knife i mean it's modern but manufactured in china i think we'll harvest just to get it out of here bottom's really soft and the bad part about that is it's all new silt that's covering up everything that should be hard and stuck to the bottom oh wow we've been walking a long way and we are, have run out of glass, run out of trash, run out of everything. So maybe in the line, if we pass this one big tree up here, if there's nothing on the uh, on the bar, sand gravel bar thing, we're gonna hit the bank. I climbed down that bank a minute ago and didn't fall. It's pretty impressive myself. There's nothing, huh? It's just a bunch of broken bricks, huh? The tough part is it's nice and shallow on up there now. So you gotta ask yourself, how far do you wanna go? All right, we picked one more bar to walk to here. Here it is. So if there's no glass on this one, we are turning around. For sure. Problem is, there's always one more sandbar. Always one more gravel pile you want to look at. So there we go. We decided I'm just hauling two bricks out. He's hauling his one. So remember this and this and this and this were found on the last video, but it's still the same event. So we're here. Let's keep moving. It's getting kind of deep here. We have managed to uh, go further downstream, but. Huh? Uh, it's kind of shallowing up now a little bit. November 15th, 1915. That's a 1915. 1915. Birmingham? No, it's not. Ansley, Arkansas? Raleigh, North Carolina. Oh, really? That's a good one. See if they can just keep it's it. It's in pretty good shape. I will harvest. It falls in the age bracket of the mother bottles for sure. I can't believe you even saw that. Yeah, the problem with walking downstream is you. So we stir it up, but this water's not moving fast, so hopefully we can outrun our backwash. What is that? Or is that terracotta pot? Yeah. I don't know. No, that's a that's a lip to a big churn or a jug. I know y'all like how much we find in the creeks. Look at that, Jilly. This is a mannequin. Actually, it's a womacan with a bunch of bullet holes in it. That was a bad idea. Now I have seriously dingied up my looking around spot. Big one, isn't it? I can't see. That was like a big coke. Yep, that's a big one. The beast coke. So this is down here. That's going to get really deep here in a minute, so it doesn't really affect you, though. Kind of a change of pace here. The water cleared up. It got wider, a lot cleaner, and almost no trash. 
but there's so many rocks. I just got a feeling there's not going to be a bottle in here. This will probably be my last bottle. Whole tiny perfume to wrap up in the day. So that one, the Coke, was on this trip. I guess that was it. Well, anyway, unless I find something else, thanks for watching my videos.